What's up, you guys? This is uh, IFBB Pro, Cody Montgomery, coming at you guys from uh, Delray Beach, Florida. I actually just moved here, um, like you guys saw in the announcement video. If you guys haven't seen it, go check it out on uh, Blackstone Labs' Facebook page. Um, so yes, I have moved to Florida. I just got a new contract with Blackstone, and we are gonna take you guys through a shoulder workout today at uh, Busybody. So follow along, we'll get some good content for you guys. And you know, I'm just getting my off season going uh, officially, so uh, it's time to get big. So let's go to the gym and uh, lift some weight. All right, guys, so we're gonna start our uh, shoulder workout with some side lateral raises on this machine, warm up our shoulders, uh, get a good little pump going, and then we'll probably go into a, uh, like a shoulder press of some sort. Just kind of feel it out with the gym, so let's go. So now we are on to our second exercise. We're gonna be doing a Smith machine shoulder press. And the uh, goal here is gonna be about, uh, you know, 10 to 12 reps. We're gonna do uh, four working sets and nothing crazy as far as weight. I just wanna more so feel it and uh, get a good squeeze and contraction up the top and feel out the negative. So let's get it. third exercise is going to be a dumbbell side lateral. I'm going to do it one arm and I'm just going to try to get a good uh, contraction and feel it out. I'm not going to go super, super heavy. More so just try to um, get a deep, like pretty good form. But when I do it, what you'll notice is I'm going to try to go more out than up, which I think a lot of people make a mistake. So watch that. And when you guys are doing it, make sure to think about pushing the weight out towards the wall rather than towards the ceiling. And you're going to get a, a much better, uh, pump from it. So now we are gonna move on to our fourth exercise. We're gonna be doing a um, straight bar upright row, just to give some cap to the shoulder, get a little uh, thickness to, to the overall delt. And we'll do about 10 reps on here, three to four sets, and uh, let's get it. Alright, so our last exercise today uh, is going to be some uh, reverse pec deck on this uh, pec fly machine. So we'll do it for our rear delts and we'll uh, finish strong. Let's get it.
everybody. So we just got done training. Um, took you guys through a little bit of a uh, shoulder workout, high volume. It was pretty short as you guys saw, just a few exercises, but uh, short and to the point. You know, get in, get a pump, and then get out. Um, so we're gonna go fuel up, get a little uh, Formula 19, and uh, some other good Blackstone Labs products in post-workout, and uh, take you guys through a little uh, post-workout meal. What I'm doing right now, as far as my post-workout nutrition, and uh, everything like that so I appreciate you guys uh, watching the video and now that I'm here in Florida be expecting tons more videos lots more content both from Blackstone and myself on my YouTube page uh, so I appreciate all the support guys and uh, you know try to work out for yourself let me know how you like it all right guys so I'm gonna take you guys through my post workout meal um, it's about 30 minutes 45 minutes since we trained and uh, you know very easy meal that you guys can uh, try at home um, this is definitely my highest carb meal of the day and uh, you know basically it's all carbs and, and some protein uh, fast acting uh, isolation from Blackstone Labs I'm gonna do a, a probably do vanilla today um, and then I use it as a milk with uh, with some cereal um, do some gluten-free cereal so show you guys uh, what I do first of course is uh, just some isolation vanilla, like I said. We'll do uh, two scoops. And then we're gonna go over here and get some ice, excuse me. Now we have our protein for the meal, and then we're gonna get it. This stuff is actually imported from Kuwait. I'm just kidding, it's from uh, Publix, but it's the Nature's Path Organic Corn Flakes, which is what I'm doing for cereal. So, what we will do is get a bowl, get a scale, and do 100 grams of that. But there we go, and so all we're going to do is I'll show you guys. Use this as your milk base. Do a little bit of that and then drink the rest. And there you have it. That's a super easy post workout meal that I've been uh, recently doing. And check it out, try it out, and uh, I'm about to dig in. So we are uh, on to the next meal. And as everyone knows, I love pasta. So this meal is chicken and pasta, uh, six ounces of chicken and 160 grams of pasta, dry weight, and we're gonna dig in. So this is uh, this is meal three out of six meals I'll do today.